Light. We need more light. Okay, so this is a slightly different video than any of the other kind of part of love videos because uh, it's a labor of love. It's about time. It's about doing things with your hands. I don't know. It's not We're a usual part of love. love. We're doing it out of love. So I'm doing it out of love. We're trying to make part of love over here and to make part of love happen, we have to do some crazy things. And one of the crazy things that we have to do today is build a light because we need more lights. We need more light. We have this beautiful ring light, but it's not enough for what we've got coming for you guys. So we needed more lights. We can't get any lights delivered with the current state of things. You can't get lights for like a month. So we were like, what if we made some lights? These things are the things that you're gonna need to make the light that we made. Duct tape or Gorilla tape in this case. A work clamp light. Some sort of laundry basket. It's flimsy. A shower curtain, aluminum foil, and a light bulb. This one is 5500 Kelvin daylight light bulb. Um, yeah. Also, you're gonna need some time. So <laughs> that's the one thing you're putting into this. You're putting in time. Missy is playing like crazy. So happy. This is gonna be fun. It's gonna be a good night. Oh yeah. I'm gonna go get the wine. It's gonna be the best. Most important thing, you get your helpers. Who wants to wear the hat? <laughs> oh my God. Get your laundry basket, flimsy thing. Grab some scissors and you're just gonna cut right along this bottom area. A couple of reasons you don't wanna try and cut the bottom out, because we did try that. And the problem is, even with like a nice knife, watch out my hand, thank you. You can get through it, but it's, it's just really thick. Any of my knife loving friends, please don't be mad at me that I just did that. How many are you cutting off? I'm gonna cut the whole thing off. Yeah. Now you've got a bottom, which now doubles as a plate. <laughs> Step one, halfway complete. This is a 10 and a half inch. You okay? Yeah. <laughs> 10 and a half inch clamp light. I don't know, it was under $10. I want it to be right about here, or I did. So you see how it's like bowing out right there? Mm -hmm. So what we're gonna do is, we're gonna cut one of these out on each side. And to make them kind of come together and form a smaller hole at the bottom, you're just gonna bring them over like that and tape them. I have two helpers, <laughs> none of which have opposable thumbs. So let's see how I do. We made one earlier and she helped out like a whole bunch. Yeah, if you have a partner, it really pays off time-wise. I'm just gonna cross this over. Yeah. There's no wrong way to <laughs> Gorilla Tape something. This stuff is so fucking crazy strong. You can't really fuck it up. It's not gonna come apart. I don't even think a Gorilla can tear it apart. Hey, look at that, that looks, that looks nice. Next thing, drop it down in. So push it down as far as it will go. This is gonna be way harder alone. Well, do you want me to set this up so I can hold? And then they can see what it's like to have a partner. I would love that. Okay. And just refilling. Now get your drinks at the ready. So it's literally so fucking strong that if you just get that first one on there, like you can let go of it because it's, it's in there now. Okay, so now you're all taped around the bottom, kind of see your shell. Now, what you might be asking yourself is, did you do this backwards? Shouldn't you have put the aluminum foil in? No, all of this was like happy accidents that just kept yeah. working out when we made the first one. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna take tape and you're gonna build essentially a cage of tape around this, a, a sticky wall on the inside for your aluminum foil reflector. It, trust us, it comes out It's crazy. It's pretty cool. And the tape really, I'm shocked, like it makes it sturdy. You oh know? yeah. Like the the, the if light itself, if it tape? drops, it, it's not gonna fall apart like cardboard or anything like that. Like if it drops, it's protected and it's, it's sturdy. Yeah, no, yeah. this is, we're making you a sturdy Sturdy, so. <laughs> sturdy light. You can have this for a second. We don't know when Amazon's gonna be delivering anytime soon. Exactly. Make them yourself. And honestly, hmm. we're saving a buck. We're saving a lot of bucks. Yeah. We could sell these on Etsy. Maybe not. I have to make. We have to make it look a little better. It looks great. <laughs> no, it looks. Make sure the person doing this is very strong, like me. So strong. Nice. Did you see me oh. lean back. <laughs> now on the inside. Can you hear that? When we get to the aluminum foil part, all will be revealed. Don't eat my hand. It's, it's, it's worth it. You can make four of these, and at the end of yep. it, it will take less time and money than pressing click on Amazon and waiting for new lights to come. Put an audible on, get your wine. Here we go. On this edition of The Tape, 
we'll be reading a passage from Basket Tape. Tape. All right, check that out. It's sturdy. And inside, it is extremely sticky. So the next part, it's like one of the last steps. So the trick that we found just to make the helper's job a little easier is like, I think about 12 inch strips, and then you're just gonna fold it in thirds and rip that apart. Cause you wanna have like separate little pieces to kind of work in there. That's just what we found. You can do what you want. I tear it, and then I just hand it to him and he just kind of lays it in there. Yeah. That's why I don't get anything done. <laughs> Stick it right down in there as best you can, and you can wrap it down. And you can start to see already, like, it's all very reflective-y. <laughs> Technical term. As you can see, you have a full reflector inside, thusly extending that little clamp light that we had before. We're just gonna add a little tape ring around the outsides, you know, make sure to hold everything in place. So you see, just gonna tape that part down, and it also gives it kind of a uniform look. Makes it look all super professional and stuff. Unless you're gonna go with the chrome package. In which case, we're gonna leave everything exposed fully. You know, hey, do you, bro. Let's pull it together. Just so you know, this one is coming out way nicer than the first one did. The first one is a <laughs> lot of pieces in a lot of places. One of those, like, trial and error things. Yeah. You got the little ring around the edges. It's just gonna hold everything together. Second to last part is gonna be putting a light in here. We're gonna add our shower curtain over the top of it so that we get a little bit of softening because this is gonna be super fucking bright. There we go, oh ho ho. So the last part is what makes a soft box soft. We just use this lightweight shower curtain. Yeah, I think it was two bucks. So what we're gonna do is Now that you got your circle, just gonna cut it out. Down there. Couldn't really believe how this all came together. No shit. There's your light. We put the light bulb in there, right? Yeah, we did. <gasps> just wait till we plug it in. It's gonna look exactly like this is craziness. All right, so we can show you that it works. Obviously it works, but we gotta show you how it works. We kind of showed you that at the beginning, but now we'll do a little compare and contrast to show you what it looks like with and without these lights. Okay, so if you only have one light, you just need some kind of light. This For is us, just one this light. This is just one of these lights. Now, with our ring light, I didn't plug it in. That's the make or break, because it, it's like, if you don't have the ring light, what do you do? And honestly, That's this this looks so good for right now. If we, I'm excited to see what two of these looks like, because we haven't yeah. had it. I apologize, I, my hair looks crazy. Crazy! <laughs> All right, here we go, here we go. Okay. Let's see what happens. <gasps> Look, I get it, it's not gonna be the perfect setup, but if you don't have anything else, this, is awesome. I'm guesstimating like one is around, is between 15 and 20. Let's say it's like 18 bucks. Four of them, we're talking like $70. That's, a, that's amazing. If but you, this is just with two. So two for like $35. Around 60, 70 bucks for four lights. That's crazy. Now, obviously they don't have any features. There's no dimming there. But like, look at that. So if we had no, none of these lights, ready? None of these lights, Ooh. one of these lights, two of these lights, if you no, are on a budget and you need something, do it yourself. You got time right now. It's gonna save you a ton of money and Amazon's not delivering lights right now anyway. You might not have no choice. Like, trust us, we didn't. This all came out of your brain, so thank you. This is really, really freaking cool. Thank, I was thank you. not a believer at first. I'm gonna, I'm not gonna lie. I gotta say thank you to YSL Imaging, Daniel Schiffer, and Peter McKinnon. Thank you so much for making your Make a Light tutorials. These lights work, y'all. If you get a chance to do it, do it. Because sometimes, as much as it sucks, you can't just like press and click and have something happen. And to tie it back in, every once in a while, you gotta do it yourself. And sometimes doing it yourself is a part of love. I made it work! Nice! Hey! <laughs> it's playtime. You wanna go play? Let's go play. <laughs> all right, all right, all right.